when it, it make, they're making it bigger than, you know, they're making it so big now. The, even the charges and what they're saying, it's just, it's, it's bigger than who I am now, so. What do you think they're doing this for? You were talking, talking to the elevator. Doing. What do you think they're doing it for? Why they're doing this to you? Because, I mean, the way this country is successful is if we have one set of rules and everybody follows them. If anybody gets outside of that set of rules and they're in a the public view like I am, you know, it, it may, it's like detrimental to everybody following the rules if, if I'm representing like to what, what they think is that I represent lawlessness and the outlaw mentality and I represent that thug mentality from the street. So they feel like if they can punish me, then it'll punish people who are not as brave as I am, who don't speak out against, who about, uh, speak out against things like me, who not scared to walk through the streets with no bodyguards. See, they need to put me in jail. These other guys, they don't have to put in jail because they can arrest them on smaller things. They can't arrest me on no small things. They got to frame me. They got to do things like this. They got to have, you know, 30 charges and none of them have to do with me. You know what I'm saying? How can you, if you really, while all these cameras are here, everybody goes on to grow on. How am I going to forcibly do anything to a girl after she did it to me consensually and that's not something I'm making up that's what they said they said that the girl came to court and said she did this she did that she called my hotel it was good she said that not me now why am I gonna force her I mean this is common sense but no matter what happens innocent or guilty my life is ruined because when they say whatever whatever they say in this verdict y'all are not gonna make it front page news it won't be bigger no matter what all that you want to hear is that he's guilty He's in jail, the reign of terror is over, the outlaw is gone, that's what they want to do. So it's, I'm, I'm starting to think, I don't know which story to read. I don't know if this is, you know, about, you know, black and white and, 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 and loud and quiet, or is it about me and this girl? Because if it's about me and this girl, come on, we shouldn't even why, be here. Coming down the elevator, why you complain. Why would she make something like that up? Why would she make something like that up? Because hell have no fury like a woman scorned. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm, I'm guilty of a lot of things. I'm guilty probably of being a male chauvinist pig. I'm guilty of probably um, not caring as much as I should. I'm guilty of not spending enough time with people like I should. But I'm not guilty of rape. Just because I don't want to be with that girl don't mean that she has the right to say that I did all of these things that I didn't do. You know what I'm saying? Just because, I mean, of course I can't spend my life with all the girls that I, I you know, I'm, I, I spend time with. But I'm not married. You know what I'm saying? That's not a crime for me to be promiscuous. It's not a crime for me to be with any girl I want. To be with. It's a crime for that girl to turn that into a rape charge. But don't you think it's the circumstances here? Yeah, don't you think it's the circumstances here that is, is what one discussed? She wasn't prepared, she says, for what happened to her and it wasn't supposed to happen. Okay, so she wasn't prepared for what happened to her. Where are those people that did this? They were all in the same hotel as me. They were all right in the same room as me. Why am I the only one in court right now? Why is the cameras all on me? And in the report, in all these charges, I didn't do nothing. I'm, I'm charged with being in concert with some guy. Well, where they at? Why me? Because I'm too pop. No, I'm not angry at them. I'm angry at the system. I don't want nobody else to go to jail. You know what I'm saying? But I don't want to go to jail for something I didn't do. You know what I'm saying? I just don't want to be the scapegoat. I just want to be, I want to be, only way I've, I've been practicing my whole life to live my life is to be responsible for what I do. I don't know how to be responsible for what every black male did. I don't know. I, yes, I am going to say that I'm a thug. That's because I came from the gutter and I'm still here. I'm not saying I'm a thug because I want to rob you and rape people and things. I'm a businessman. I mean, I mean, you know I'm a businessman because you find me at my places of business. You don't find me up in, in you know what I'm saying? I don't understand this. I don't understand what, what this. What do you think about the jury? You talk about the jury. You talk about the jury. They look at this trial and they say, you know, here's a rap star, here's an actor. What kind of sex is you engaging? This isn't safe sex. What do you say to that? But it is safe sex, because the, in, the, in the um trial, in the transcripts, if y'all dig deep and be reporters, you'll find out I wore a condom. It was her who sodomized me. It wasn't me who went down in the dance club and ate her out. It was her in the dance club who had oral sex with me. She should be charged, not me. What kind, They're making like I'm some big, gruesome animal, a sex animal, wait, 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 which is a... Charge, your charge involves this. So-called gangbang in the hotel. No, it doesn't. It does not. But what, if you listen right in there, none of these charges of this gangbang, none of this gangbang stuff came out in the trial. She says people was rubbing her ass, grabbing her ass. Where are these people? 
Where are these people? No, she said that the, it's an attempted sodomy. What is an attempted sodomy? That, if there was sodomy, if there was sodomy, okay, if there was sodomy, why when she went to the doctor, wasn't there any force wrench? Why wasn't her anal? Why wasn't anything? Why, why didn't they find any of my sperm on the, on the, on the thing? If, if she's, why? Why? Why wasn't any of my sperm? Why didn't they find a condom? Uh, you just said you're right, right, right. Why you did you they find you? Said you on the night we had consensual sex, right, right. before okay. that. Yeah. Come on, follow me. me follow ask, me. Let me ask you this about the guns. What do you think? Oh, sure. What about the guns? What about the guns? That's Getting the other thing trouble? that you're. No, it's not. It's not has nothing. It's not my liking for guns. Why, what about the NRA? We all have a right to bear arms. Right. I have that. I have that same right as you do. Just because I'm black doesn't mean I shouldn't have a gun. I have a law legally own guns. I legally own guns. Why would I come to New York and be unlawfully owning two guns? Who has two guns? Who carries two unlegal guns? Why? You were, you were, I, I, and mind you, a week before I, I, I went to jail with the police. Come on. What about the jury? You talked to him in the elevator about the jury and yes. the composition of it. You didn't think they, they understood you. Tell me about that. I hope they do, Bob. It's hard for me to believe that a jury full of older, more middle class women are going to understand where I'm coming from. Because y'all barely understand where I'm coming from. And y'all cover murders and shit every day. And y'all treat me like I'm New York's most notorious criminal and y'all know it's people throwing babies out of windows and putting them in the incinerator all i do is make raps all i do is rap and talk loud my biggest crime is talking loud you know what i'm saying y'all don't have nothing else besides that The whole reason I didn't do the spitting and everything is so we can, we can not have this. I appreciate that too. Can you please not block the car? You You know, she didn't. Wait, wait. Right. She's she's a groupie. You were talking about yeah, that. What do you think that's all about? I think she went to. She actually probably did go to have sex, and things didn't work out the way she expected them. You know, and then she just called rape on him. But um, I don't think it's fair. I think she should pay for what she done to him. You think on the he's dance being floor? scapegoated? You know, like he's being nailed just because of who he is? Yeah, probably. And what you said earlier, what you think? I mean, w women like that that are going for that. I mean, ah, they're going for sex. Same thing with Tyson, you know. You're going in there for something, you know. People don't hang around you 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. They constantly call you. You're going for something, okay? And if things don't work out the way you expect them, why would you call Ray? You know, do you done you done it. Just go ahead about your business and leave it like that, right? Okay. And where are you? Are you from uh, Manhattan or Brooklyn or what? Queens. Queens. Yeah, that was my next guest. And let me get your name and the spelling of your last name. Lady. Lady?